Hey guys, this is Leah with Scott Leroy Marketing and in today's tip video I'm going to show you how you can actually download or print your forms from DocuSign without the sample watermark. So the sample watermark feature is a newer item that was added in probably within the last six months. Um, so you might be seeing these now on your forms. Um, so you'll see some of my forms here do say sample. And how you remove that is just by opening and editing the form. Even editing a single field on the form will remove that sample watermark. So when you pull that into an envelope and send it to your clients, it will not be there. And I'll put um, a uh, the link in the YouTube description below to the other video that will show you that full process. Um, in today's tip video, I'm going to show you specifically how to remove that for printing or downloading your forms. All right, so I will need to, as a first step, make sure you are creating your opportunity in command first to then click start a transaction to create your room in DocuSign. All right, so you want to create your room in DocuSign first and where you'll be adding those forms is directly to your DocuSign room. You do need to pull that into the documents tab. Okay, so feel free to pause the video if you do need to create an opportunity and if you need steps on creating an opportunity to create your DocuSign room, that, you know, that workflow that KW requires, uh, I will uh, include another link in the description of the YouTube video below for you to check out for that. Alright, so once you have your DocuSign room created here, we'll come to the Documents tab and click on Add on the top right. Alright, so if you don't already have that form in your room, you can add those by clicking on Add on the top right, select DocuSign Forms. To select the forms that you want to pull in, you can pull that in based on group on the left hand side, libraries, simply click on the checkbox and click add selected to add those forms. And again, full steps, a lot slower paced, that'll be in the YouTube description below. Alright, so let's talk about if that form comes in and you're seeing the word sample here. Okay, in order to print this form, so if you want to print it and bring it on your listing appointment with you or whatever the case may be, you just need to fill in one field on the form and then it will remove that word sample. So KWRI, to help with this, because this has to do with the agreement with the board um, from what I've heard, so KW, to help with that, has added some extra fields on your forms. So just like little forms on the bottom or fields on the bottom of the form you might see you know, that'll help with that. So I could go ahead and put in the phone number or the fax number here and even editing or the property address would of course be another good one. You know, whatever your form looks like here, of course that will vary. So let's say I'll put this in. Click save and close. So this is very important after you make a single edit. All right, so this is if you're trying to print the form. You need to make sure you're clicking save and close first. All right, you can access the print option at this time. If you don't save and close it first, it will not save that edit and remove the sample watermark. All right, so I still see it, just a heads up, you will still see it on the icon here or the preview of the form, so don't be alarmed by that. But now to go ahead and print it without that sample watermark, I'm gonna go ahead and click on the form again to pull that up. Okay, I see my edit did save on the bottom. So now I'll come up to document actions on the very top right. And I can go ahead and click on print. So now this is the print preview, right? So I don't see the word sample anymore, right? And I do have that single edit here. And I can go ahead and print this. It might look different depending on your browser. I'm in Chrome. But if I print that, first of all, I can save that as a PDF or switch to my printer to print that right away. All right, guys, if you have any questions on how that works, please feel free to reach out. Support at scottleroymarketing.com. We'd be more than happy to help with any further questions. Hope you have a great rest of your day and hope this helps.